Hey guys, what is up? The Holy Emerald here, and today we will be doing a video on the top five facts on the player about the player. So like the video as it does help help out the channel a lot, and leave a comment, retweet, do whatever you gotta do, uh, share, and without further ado, let's get right into it. Number five. A few days ago, and when I say few days ago, basically two and a half years ago, before 0.6.0, same thing. Well, what? The default name for the lead character Steve was actually listed as Stevie with a smiley face. This was actually a Pocket Edition limited feature until Johan later confirmed on Reddit that they were actually trying to keep a nickname for Steve in the Pocket Edition, but in January, a month after uh, following this Reddit post, 0.6.1 was actually released and for an unknown reason, he had removed the IE and replaced it with just me. Number 4. In Minecraft Pocket Edition, there are currently two default skins in the game. Steve, the male model, and Alex, the female model. However, the Alex female model actually has the same dying sound as the male model. Yes, I am the best person in the world to realize this. This doesn't seem like a glitch as the game cannot currently detect a female skin from the male skin, so we have to assume that Alex is actually a boy? Gosh, I know so many boys with the name of Alex. What if Alex was a fake? Illuminati confirmed. What is the difference between the Steve and Alex skin? That's where number three comes and kicks in place. Alex is a more feminine skin than Steve with thinner arms, four, 3px than 4px, and also a smaller body than Steve. This seems to be a version exclusive feature. Don't worry though, Steve. You can actually do anything what Alex does, because guess what? In Minecraft, you can do anything, no matter their size. Insert smiley face here. Unless you're a total faggot, which everyone, of course, will hate. Moving on, number two. When Minecraft PE had actually started as a demo, way back 2011, skin packs were actually implemented. Yep, this is hard to believe, but you could choose up to five skins when the game started. However, due to older devices not being able to handle this, the idea was shelved. Anyways, there was no option to choose one of the five skins in the options menu or whatever. Each time you were to start a new game on MCPE, you will find your skin changed. Sucky process, huh? Number one. This mind-blowing fact will totally cook your potatoes into french flies. French flies. I meant french fries, whatever. The player's armor weight is actually nothing compared to the legit Minecraft's listings by strength. Gold is the heaviest, iron surprisingly is the next heaviest, then diamond, leather, and finally chain. So if you did like this video, I am looking forward to hear your feedback and leave a like if you did enjoy as always. Thank you for watching, tune in for another video, subscribe, and goodbye for now.